Hey YouTubers, today we have a 2020 Toyota Corolla. I will show you how to do this lower control arm. It calls for a lot of time, but it won't take too much. So, starting out, what I did was go ahead and replace or take out the lower ball joint. It comes separately from the lower control arm. Um, secondly, I went ahead and took the sway bar link out the strut. And went underneath, there's a whole bunch of plastic, so want to make sure I have full access to everything so took that off there's going to be a whole bunch of these push pins in there um, and some 10 mil bolts up here up front but what I did next was go ahead and lower down the subframe a little bit so 19 mil and make sure you still thread it in probably like four threads 19 mil right there same thing and 19 mil right here same thing um, one thing I would be wary of is there's an O2 sensor right here there's a 10 mil Go ahead and just get that out of the way just to make sure you don't mess that up by any means. So this is the boat that causes for so much labor time. It's going to be a 24 mil boat and it sits in there just like that. And as you can see, there was no transmission here. It'll easily come out. But um, what I did was I moved this arm out the way. It's a, I think some 13 mil bolts right here, right here, just easier access. But as soon as you do that, what you can do is grab a pry bar. This is my Harbor Freight pry bar. And just pry down and then you'll have all the access right here that you need to get that bolt out. And at that point, I just grabbed a 24 mil socket, put it on a wobble and half inch came straight out. So took that out. I'm gonna take this bolt out and this local charm will come straight out. Hope this helped you. Please like, leave a comment, 